Hey, it's Coach Freddie here, just bringing back the American dream. Jack Canfield's success principle number 10 is release the brakes. Have you ever been driving with your car and suddenly realized that you left the emergency brake on? So what did you do? Step on the gas? No, you simply released the brake and you automatically went faster. A lot of people are driving through life with their psychological emergency brake on. They hold on to all the negative images about themselves. They stay in a comfort zone of their own making. And when they try to achieve their goals, these negative images and comfort zones always cancel out their good intentions, no matter how hard they try. Now, on the other hand, successful people have discovered that instead of increasing, using increased willpower as the engine to power their success, it's just simpler to release the brakes by letting go and replacing their limited beliefs and changing their self images. Now you can think about your comfort zone as a prison that you live in, a self created prison. It consists of a collection of can'ts, must, must nots, uh, and other uncomfortable, unfounded beliefs formed from all the negative thoughts that you've reinforced during your lifetime. Maybe you've trained her to limit yourself. If that's the case, then you can untrain yourself. You can use affirmations and new internal images and simply change your behavior. We have to stop recreating the same experiences over and over. See, successful, successful people understand that you really are never stuck. You just keep recreating the same stuff over and over with the same thoughts. Now, too often we get stuck in an endless loop of reinforced behavior in a constant downward spiral because we're constantly thinking about what we don't want. Now, to change this cycle, we have to focus on thinking, talking, and writing about what we do want to create. We have to flood our unconscious mind with those thoughts and images of what we want to create, our new reality. Now we can do this through affirmations. An affirmation is a statement that describes a goal that is already completed. And it's stated like, I am living in beautiful St. Thomas, Virgin Islands, running my successful coaching business from my world headquarters at Compass Point Seaport Village, or something better. Now here's a few guidelines for your affirmations to be effective. Start with the words, I am. Use the present tense. Affirm what you want, not on what you don't want. Keep it brief. Make it specific. Include an action word ending in ing. Now, you create an image that you're doing it now. Like, I am running my successful coaching business. Then at the end, add, or something better. Sometimes there's something better that is available to us. Affirmations work. That's how I got here. I'm here at Compass Point Seaport Village, St. Thomas, U.S. Virgins, in my world headquarters office. I'm sitting at my desk, looking at the docks, the beautiful boats, through my 10-foot picture window. That's really how I got here. I affirmed the Virgin Islands, St. Thomas, Compass Point Seaport Village, a world headquarters office, looking at the beautiful boats, all except for the 10-foot picture window. I guess that's the or something better. Hey, this is Coach Freddie, just bringing back the American dream. Are you driving with your brakes on? Hey, leave me a uh, comment down here. Love to hear from you. Take care, and I'll see you next time.